What's up everybody, welcome back to Solenix Crypto, hope you're all doing great and welcome to this new video on Pepe Unchained, a new meme coin slash project, I'm not sure if we can fully call this a meme coin, but a new project launching very very soon, um, it's in the pre-sale phase right now, so we'll talk about that, I think the, 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 the project has potential, although there are some things we need to talk about that could also cause it to uh, have a little bit less potential. Uh, but we'll we'll just do a full update, all right? So if you don't know the project, I will tell you about that. But we'll also do an update on the launch date, uh, what they are doing right now in terms of developments, and I also wanted to talk a little bit about uh, how Pepe Unchained is being portrayed right now in a, in a lot of media sources, uh, which I don't fully agree with, all right? So that's what we'll do now. If you don't know, Pepe uh, Unchained is a new project <clears throat> that's in the pre-sale phase right now. Uh, which means that you can hopefully buy it at a lower price than the launch. Um, we have seen some pre-sales in the past where it actually opened, uh, well, it opened at the price a little bit higher, but then you could, sh should have sold very early to have made a profit, um, which hopefully will be different for Peppa Unchained. Um, but you can buy it right now and then it will launch probably somewhere in September, but it is unsure and uncertain yet when. Um, and last week, I, I thought we would get some some more news about that. It seems to me that they're maybe waiting on on the product to be developed a little bit more, and that it will be towards the towards the like third fourth week of uh, of September. But there's no concrete information on that. Uh, but if you want to buy this, there will be a link down in the description, and there you can uh, uh, check out the website, and then you can buy it right here with Ethereum USDT. Uh, or BNB, <clears throat> I would uh, I, I would um, uh, encourage you to buy it with uh, with BNB. Also, since I don't think you should stake your tokens, even though a lot of people have done that, but that's up to you. So um, yeah, wanted to talk about it. Basically, what the project is is they're building their own layer two blockchain, uh, which is quite interesting. All right, if if these pre sales are actually building something, um, historically that has always led to better performer better performance. Not always. Um, but what I do like about Pepper Unchained is that at least they're relatively active when, when you when you join their their groups, and if you for example look at um, if you for example look at this, they posted an update last week about what they're doing with their own decentralized exchange that they're building, which is a hard fork of Uniswap. It looks like, but still they're doing something, their own uh, block explorer and their own bridge. So. Look, I've been quite critical about Pepper Unchained and whether I think this layer two blockchain will actually be used. And I'm still very skeptical about that. But the fact that they are actually building something and that they are actually wor working on this is at least a sign of competence, which you would also always like to see when uh, you're buying into a project. So I think it's bullish nonetheless, wh whether, you, whether you think it's going to have value in the long term, yes or no. But that's what it is. And, uh, and uh, Pepu, which is the name of the token, which you can buy now, will be the main token in that whole layer two blockchain they're building uh, but if you want to know more about this then you can uh, go to the website down in the description and uh, go to their x uh, which is here at the top which uh, hopefully you can see no you cannot um here at the top you can go to their telegram and their and their x but be careful for, uh, for for scammers because there are a ton of scammers on there um but yeah so they have already raised almost 13 million dollars which is one of the key reasons why i do think this has potential um, if you if you look back at pre-sales that raised this much, a lot of them at least were able to be profitable. Most of them were not uh, uh, amazing in the long term, but the main goal with these pre-sales is to make a profit. All right. So I do think with, with the money they have, I mean, they can at least get some centralized exchange listings. They can do some buybacks. They can get listed on all the coin market cap, etc. So that's that's a good start. Um, however, and and that's kind of now I want to be a little bit more negative. And for the record, I did buy Pepper Unchained in the pre-sale, but I will also buy after launch because a lot of pre-sales in the past have not performed well. Now um, I think the market circumstances are getting a bit more different, and I think the market circumstances are getting better for these types of pre-sales. But still, we haven't had a successful pre-sale in in the last two months or so. So that's a reason to be cautious. So be cautious while buying this. Definitely like check this out yourself. Check if you want to buy this. Um, you, you definitely don't need to buy this. There's there's tons of opportunities in the markets. I think Pepper Unchained will be profitable, but it, it remains high risk. Um, and then apart from that, what I what I see a lot about um, about Pepper Unchained in the media right now is, is like clickbait. 
um, such as like a 100x loading or a, a 10x loading and no shades to, to other people covering Pepper Unchained. It's a big project and there is a lot of hype around it, so I, I get it. But this will probably not do a 10 or 100x, all right? Um, I, I would I would say it has a 1% uh, chance of doing that. No other pre-sale has done that in the, or no other pre-sale of, of this kind has done that in the last two years. Trust me, I, I, I would know. Um, so be careful with that. It, regardless of that fact, I still do, do think it has potential, but you should treat, treat it as a, as, as a high risk uh, opportunity. But those are my thoughts for now. Um, I'll be back with a market update later today if you're interested in that. But for now, I think that's what you need to know. So thank you for watching. Take care and bye.